He turned out of the race for the White House after that high-stakes presidential debate. Tonight, the new Reuters-Ipsos poll taken after the debate, showing Kamala Harris now leading Donald Trump 47 to 42. Tonight, Vice President Harris challenging the former president to another face-off. Donald Trump now saying there will not be another debate. Here's Mary Bruce tonight. Out on the trail for the first time since her face-off with Donald Trump, Kamala Harris in North Carolina tonight, hoping to carry the debate momentum forward. Two nights ago, Donald Trump and I had our first debate. And I believe we owe it to the voters to have another debate. Because this election and what is at stake could not be more important. Harris arguing the debate shows Trump is a man of the past without a plan for the future, singling out the issue of health care. At the debate, Lindsey Davis asking him about his long-standing promise to replace the Affordable Care Act, known as Obamacare. Last month, you said, quote, we're working on it. So tonight, nine years after you first started running, do you have a plan, and can you tell us what it is? Obamacare was lousy health care, always was. It's not very good today. And what I said, that if we come up with something, and we are working on things, we're going to do it, and we're going to replace it. So just a yes or no, you still do not have a plan? I have concepts of a plan. I'm not president right now. Harris today mocking that answer. He said, he said, concepts of a plan. Concepts, concepts. No actual plan, concepts. And understand what's at stake on that. 45 million Americans are insured through the Affordable Care Act. And he's going to end it based on a concept. Going into the debate, polls had the candidates roughly tied. Today, a new Reuters Ipsos poll has Harris leading Trump 47 to 42. But the vice president warning supporters. Ours will be a very tight race until the end, okay? It's going to be a tight race until the end. And we are the underdog. Understand that. We are the underdog. According to the Reuters Ipsos poll, 53% of voters who heard anything about the debate said Harris was the winner. Only 24% said the same about former President Trump. But in Arizona tonight, Trump declaring victory. As everyone saw two nights ago, we had a monumental victory over comrade Kamala Harris in the presidential debate. Still, Trump saying that after one matchup against Biden and another against Harris, he's done with debates. Because we've done two debates and because they were successful, there will be no third debate. And so let's bring in Mary Bruce at the White House again tonight. Mary, Vice President Harris, of course, saying she wants another debate now. Former President Trump now saying he won't do it. So what's their calculation here on both sides? Well, Davis, the Harris team is certainly very pleased with her performance. They feel she had a strong night and that she was able to make clear to voters the stark contrast between the two of them. And given the massive audience, they feel they would benefit from another round. Now, Trump, you have heard, he insists he won the debate. But some of his fellow Republicans concede he had a rough night. And today he is ruling out another round, David. Mary Bruce at the White House. Mary, thank you.